What's up dudes? This is Noel on PC, and today we're gonna play some KSP. So I've been on Twitter a lot, and what I've been seeing is all of these science nerds talking about Blue Origins beating Elon Musk's SpaceX to the reusable rocket. I don't agree. So what we've done is I've built a Blue Origins type craft thingy. We're gonna replicate that launch, but Mostly, I just wanted to talk really quickly about how I feel about the SpaceX, quote, losing to Blue Origins. Just because the, the, what was it called, the Falcon 9, SpaceX's version of the reusable craft, just because it crashed on landing doesn't really mean that they didn't invent it. They invented it. It exists. It is a thing. Therefore, Blue Origins is not the first reusable. It was just the first successful landing of a reusable. So do I think that they deserve all the accolades they're getting? Yes. But it's just kind of being misinterpreted as being some kind of like a massive success when all they're really doing is just copying something someone else did, right? Giant motor, lots of gimbling, some lasers, etc. So let's uh, let's crash this thing because that's probably what's going to happen. Uh, it's a two stage. We've got the top stage is going to detach and go up to, I don't actually know, I haven't tested this yet. Uh, and this bottom stage is hopefully going to come back down and land. That's, well, you know, that's the plan. So let's, uh, let's crash this bitch. I want to go pretty much straight up. Like, pretty much straight up. Just a little bit lean. Yeah, because I want to come down somewhere around here, hopefully. I don't want to hit water. That's, that's like, that's a pretty big no-no. Speed's coming on very slowly. As much thrust as this thing has, 950 units, it's just pushing so much weight. It's got two solid booster rockets for the braking phase. It's got a huge thing of mono propellant, which I could probably turn on. Okay, we have to save about 800-ish units of fuel. Again, for the landing phase. to separate. Got about 200 units left. All right. Let's do it. All right, we're going to get this thing going pretty much straight up and Here we go. So it is ripping off into oblivion. This thing, we're going to try our hardest to just slow down a bit here. Yeah, it looks like it's still accelerating hard. Got lots of fuel left. Beauty. Get this. Get out of here, decoupler. Fuck off, decoupler. All right, now the moment of truth. Okay, I wanna go, I wanna go that way. I wish to go that way. Okay, we are accelerating, we are falling. Let me just point this way out like so. Here we go. Because again, we really, really want to hit that smooth, mostly just that smooth portion. I'm not really worried about hitting land. I'm worried about putting this thing down on a hill. <laughs> so what's straight down? Oh, geez. Yeah, no. Okay, 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 okay. I'm doing full burn. I'm trying to push it over that way. Let's do one of these. There we go. I should just about do it. We used a little bit of fuel, but you know what? We do what we get to do. Okay, this is looking much better. Much better. Actually, in fact, it's looking too good. It looks like it might come down right on top of Cape Kerbnaveral. Uh oh. 
Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> huh. Oh, there we go. Beautiful. Beautiful. So, turns out I didn't need those boosters. on a flat spot. That's looking pretty hilly down there. Luckily I've got all this RCS, like a ton of RCS, and thrust is ridiculous. It was like seven units of thrust or something. So that should be able to keep it upright, I think. I think. If the thing would keep itself upright, what the fuck is going on? Come down a little tilty. But that's okay. Boink. Oh, I dropped that last six feet. Shouldn't have done that. Okay. Whew. All right. First test of the Blue Origins reusable craft complete. Now we have to check in on the space tourism. That's the idea with this project, is to basically pop people up into a nice... Ooh, good thing we got that when we did. It's on its way back down, like, fast. The motor's obviously cut out at a certain point. Or not. No, it's just kind of hovering up here. Oh, cool. It's, like, literally hovering up here. Okay, so it is definitely not going to come down <laughs> anywhere near Cape Canaveral. But that's fine. It's uh, It's got lots of parachutes. So yeah, the idea is, is they're going to pop you, us, the tourists, um, up into orbit in this little capsule thing. Kind of like kind of like this guy, actually. Um, it's just a little dome. It's got a bunch of windows. And yeah, the idea is space tourism. They're going to pop us up into space exactly like we just did. Uh, the little pod will go away. The reusable craft is supposed to come back down and land. spot. It looks somewhat flat, actually. Looks like we're in a valley of hills. Just gotta get that chute to fucking open. There we go. Nope. Nope. Please open. Yay! Awesome. It was actually a success. That never happens. That rarely happens here. Look at this. This full-blown worked first try. Woot woot. All right. So guys, I hope you liked the mission. If you want to play it yourself, if you want to give this thing a try, I've put, as usual, I've put the link in the Dropbox. This works on 1.0.5. And guys, I hope you like the video. I hope you comment, I hope you share, I hope you, you know, do all those things you guys do as YouTubers. And dudes, until next time, peace, love, cheers.